she's smart and sassy But most of all, she's got big boobs Our community, which I have not seen in a lot of different communities I had never seen it before I moved really? here Really? No, I was the only person of color in the group Really? Yes Wow Mm-hmm I mean, you go, you go to the Lyra, you go to any other clubs, and there, there are so, I mean, there's so many wonderful people mm -hmm. in this community. Mm -hmm. I and mean, the Lyra is roughly about 3,000 or 4,000 members strong, which is um, that many people that are into BDSM. Mm -hmm. And the, our, you know, our color community is so, so intermixed with everything else. Yes, yes. And it's not segregated, which is yep. what I like yep. about it. Yeah, we have yeah, no everybody problem. knows everybody. And yep. It's a beautiful thing. You found home. Yes. So your submissive, he just moved out here, or yes. your slave, he just moved out here. Mm -hmm. And how does he like this community? Oh, he loves it. He absolutely loves it. And he's meshed in really well with everybody in the Exploration Society. Ooh. We, have a, we have a question in the chat room. <laughs> Hello, it's Rev Mel. You're on the air. Hi, Rev. Um, uh, can I ask uh, Isis a question? Sure. Um, how does uh, one go about being a proper dom? Like, what, what sort of reading materials would you suggest? Reading materials? Reading materials. That's a great question. And who are we speaking to? Hello? Hi, right, sorry. I'm and still lag, distracted by the video. All right. Okay. okay. Uh, reading materials, really, I haven't read uh, from cover to cover a whole lot of books. Um, because everybody, one thing that I've learned in the lifestyle is that as far as rules go, of course there are protocols and, and certain um, uh, rules of safety I'm, you have to adhere to. I'm having a hard time hearing you, I'm sorry. Oh. You want to speak up a little bit louder? Any better now? Can you hear uh, me now? A little bit louder, please. Can you hear me now? Can you hear yeah. me now? <laughs> I think that the best thing to do is to get with someone that you trust and uh, the best way that I learned is from actual people and actual public players because I, I think I've gotten the best perspective on uh, the lifestyle protocols and things like that just from living it in real life um, because everybody has their own opinion you know they say opinions are like assholes everybody has one and reading so many different books on such a wide range uh, BDSM covers such a huge spectrum you can get confused really easily um, if, if you want to read and if reading is your thing and that's how you learn just pick up whatever catches your eye there are plenty of books on rope there's plenty of books on on uh, first aid and all kinds of things but if you really want to get, you got to get down there in the trenches and, and learn from people who play in public. That's just my opinion. Okay. Get up and find a mentor. If you, if you see someone yes. that you like that, the way that they play, you know, ask them if they would mentor you. All right. Okay, thank you so much for that question. And if you guys have, thank you so much. And if you guys have a, another question, please call us at 323-272. 3536, and we'd be glad to answer any questions that you wish. Mm -hmm. They're talking about the assholes in here. They're saying, I must have assholes. 300 assholes. Oh, that's, that's <laughs> that was from a would make for some interesting <laughs> strap on play there. Yeah. Can you imagine doing <laughs> 300 assholes? Yeah, one, two, three. <laughs> New dance called the asshole dance. <laughs> your turn, your turn, your turn, your turn. <laughs> Ooh, she has nice breastus. Thank you. They were like moving up and down. It was really nice. <laughs> <laughs> Just got firm. I bet you they're perky too. You're all right. I've got the Wonder Bra on. I a Wonder Bra. Hat. But they're small, so they're not going anywhere. Why do you always wear something on your hair? Question. You know what? My friend Orpheus asked me this very question mm -hmm. a lot. I guess he thinks the more times he asks me, I'm going to give him a different answer. But Really, honestly, I just like them. I like yeah. the way they feel. They're comfortable. And I think it, I don't know, it just, it's just something that I, I just happen to pick up hoods when I go out shopping. I'm like, oh, this will look really cool. I just, I like the way they look. They're like, you know, like Linus with the security blanket. The hoods are kind of like my, they've kind of become my thing. It just feels good. They and I think it looks good. Master No One said she looks beautiful when she's at the lair. Oh, yeah. thank you very much. And it was amazing because one time that you did come in, mm -hmm. I didn't recognize you. Because <laughs> I didn't I, have anything on my head. You had, didn't have anything on your hair. You know, she would come into the lair when she first started coming, and she was kind of a little quiet. You know, she'd sit back and watch, and, you know, we said hello to each other. 
and uh, she was on. She did come as a guest on Orpheus' show, mm -hmm. and uh, but it was just uh, she was such a beautiful addition to the Lear to Soft. Thank you. She's like so warm, and she's bisexual. Yes. We could really top somebody at the same time. <laughs> right on. We could co-top. Yeah. Name the time and the place. And we I'm could there. We could top. We could. Do, oh, didn't you? When I had my sl my slave in a cage. In the cage? Yeah. Uh oh, he knows had my now which paddles. one one of the women that was hitting him. <laughs> Uh oh, because we kind of kept it a secret. Yeah, that was her. <laughs> <laughs> he had a good time that night. Yeah, oh, I had a great time too. I had a lot going on that night. They, they all, they all want to. They go the back door angel. They go. Um, <laughs> they go. Why don't you ladies kiss? Oh, Aww. would you guys like us to kiss? <laughs> <laughs> In the chat room, you want to see us kiss? Yeah. No, they're not saying that. They're, just, they're not no, saying, yeah, they're, kiss. They're all gonna, it's all going to be a big sweep of it's messages a big sweep. now. Yeah, you want to... Yes. Okay. No, I don't see that. They don't, they're not saying it. No, I think he's saying it. <laughs> they say my chat room's frozen. Is my chat room frozen? No. Is my chat room frozen? No. Do it. Do it, it is. It's not frozen. <laughs> it is. See, there that, it is. Look at. See. You're gonna have to trust us now. Kiss, kiss, kiss. So how should we just? I can see. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> They go, oh, please, what was, Scotch, that was not a good kiss? We missed it, do it again. You didn't miss shit. You didn't miss shit. Oh, Maddie just came. <laughs> Maddie just came. <laughs> they said the chat room was frozen. <laughs> I did slip her a tongue. They go, oh. You blinked, think, you missed they, it. They think we can do better. Well, you I know. I didn't brush my teeth. No, I didn't either. Yeah. I don't. Mm. No. Mm -hmm. Next time, baby. <laughs> we need a photograph. I don't know if my submissive knows how to take a photograph. On oh, this you, you got black. You got black lipstick. Oh, wait a minute. One. <laughs> you look like you got slit on your face. <laughs> from <lipstick>. Pussy. <laughs> 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 they want to get in the middle of this. <laughs> So, yes. Oh my goodness. Subray said, I missed it. I'm Did you get so that? Sorry. Did you get all of that? Got that? Got that? When when female dominance go wild. <laughs> should, he's looking for some way. If, if you, There is a way to take. Well, I will take a photograph later of it. Okay. Yeah, we'll just. Do yeah, do it later. All right. <laughs> they want me to stick my finger in her mouth. You want, he wants you to make me throw up? <laughs> make me gag? Is that what he wants you to do? I guess. So That's I took, weird. That's you know not what? my kink. I'm I sorry. I took all the cocks out of here. <laughs> you have you have cocks. I took all the cocks, but you know what I got? I got a T-shirt. Okay. Prize. All right. See a T-shirt? And what I want you guys to do? Okay. Here, there's the dog barking, making the. What I want you guys to do? One person will win this T-shirt. It's the rev. Oops. I'll do it one more time. I'm so sorry. My cameraman's going mal. Okay. Ready? Okay, ready for this, okay, you guys? Because this is spontaneous, and we gotta bring we gotta bring the pooch in too. Dane, we need to bring the dog in too. Okay, they say Chuck Norris. Okay, <laughs> so for the person, the first person that calls in and says "cack," <laughs> no, we're gonna do the third person that calls in and says "cack" wins a T-shirt. Ready? On your mark, call us at three two three two seven two three five three six. Ready? Cack, come on, come on. Let's do it. Cack. 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 Look at Cack. Did Cleopatra make it in? No, she didn't. All right, ready? All right. Hello, it's Rev Mal. You're on the air. Hello? Cack. Oh, that's number one. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Hello, it's Rev Mel. You're on the air. Oh, damn it, I'm number two. <laughs> you didn't say cock. <laughs> Hello, it's Rev Mel. You're on the air, but you know what? You gotta say cock. You're on the air, but you know what? You gotta say cock. Hello? Hello, cock. Yeah, but that was two because number two caller didn't.
didn't say it, so sorry. We gotta right. Number ready? Oh, we gotta say cock. Cock. <laughs> Who is this? Did I win? Yeah. Who is this? Sister Mary. Sister Mary. Is Sister this Mary. Sister Mary Wackadoo? Hello. Yep. Is this Sister Mary Wackadoo? Hello. Hello. I get. Yes. What you got to do is tell the size of the T-shirt that you need in the chat room, or private message him, and honey, I'll get you one. So she won. Yay! Thank you. Yay! Yay! That's our sister Mary Wackadoo. She's our nun that comes oh, in. Oh, nice. All right. We're gonna get. Let's get Buster. Come on, Buster. 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 Look at. Let her go. <laughs> this is nice Buster dog. the slave dog. <laughs> cha, 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 cha. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. <laughs> there we go. See, you've been watching the Rev Mel Show on TSRnetwork.com. We're real. Oh, it squeaks. Where's the head? Squeak. Squeeze the head. <laughs> Throw it. Buster. <laughs> Come here, Buster! <laughs> You've been watching the Rev Mel Show. You got to see Buster the Slave Dog. Isn't he great? So <laughs> they, they, they're saying, oh God, they want to, uh, they're writing about dog's tongue comments. Oh, oh my goodness, I don't want to know. I love you, baby, but you're a sick motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> You've been watching the Rev Mel Show where real people talk about real sex with real kinky people. And it's where we ready. It's where we keep on fucking. We'll see you guys. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. the show is over. Rev Mel needs to go and masturbate. Ow. We'd like to thank some groovy people. So watch their names on the screen and go tell them that they're great. Ow! Ooh, boo doo be bow wow. Reverend Mel is a kooky nutty gal. I love her.